Okay, take five. I'm not going to start this again. This is going to be it. So, got my books. Got my books all ready. All ready to go. February 28th is when I'm recording this. Which means tomorrow is the first day of March Mystery Madness 2022. (sighs) I managed to say it correctly this time. Uh... A lot of people on BookTube really look forward to this event, including myself. This will be my second year for the event, although I wasn't making videos last year. um, I I enjoyed it immensely. Um, March was probably, March of last year was probably my best reading month of the entire year. Uh, I read some uh, Georges Simenon. I read uh, A Study in Scarlet by Arthur Conan Doyle, the first Sherlock Holmes novel. I read some uh, Gabriel Garcia Marquez. I read Rebecca. My first entire Agatha Christie novel was last year, uh, The Body in the Library. It was just a wonderful month of reading. I'm, I'm looking really looking forward to this month, and I hope you are too. Uh, in uh, 2022, there are, again, just a ton of great co-hosts that I'm expecting some great content from throughout the month. Rather than a list of prompts this year, the event has a theme, two by two, which, as I understand, uh, readers can interpret in whatever imaginative ways uh, they choose. So here is my March Mystery Madness 2022 TBR. Uh, I'm going to start, as I've said before, with um, A.A. Milne's The Red House Mystery. A.A. Milne, of course, the creator of Winnie the Pooh. This will be the first non-Winnie the Pooh fiction that I've read from this author. I've heard that it's a really good book. Uh, We'll see. I'm expecting it that it will be. Oh, by the way, the 2 by 2 of course. The two A's and the fact that it was published in 1922. (coughs) Uh, So after that, it's kind of up in the air. A lot's going to depend on my wife. She's going to be taking part in this event too. Uh, Several of our reading, uh, our our books that we're going to be reading are going to overlap. And all of those books are going to come from her collection of uh, mysteries. She's a big mystery reader and um, we'll see. We'll see how that goes. Uh, Two books that are not are are Arthur Conan Doyle novels, uh, The Sign of the Four and The Hound of the Baskervilles. Uh, These are Sherlock Holmes novels, uh, number one and number two. And I got them from Project Gutenberg and they are waiting for me on my Kindle Paperwhite. These two books uh, are by the same author. That's the two by two. Uh, They also have some other things in common. But my wife says mentioning those are kind of dumb, so I won't. Uh, At some point in March, I'm going to uh, continue my Agatha Christie journey by reading The Secret Adversary. This is a Tommy and Tuppence novel. So we have um, two sleuths. That's two, and the other two would be uh, the fact that this book also was published in 1922. Then I'll most likely close out the month with uh, John D. McDonald's The Deep Blue Goodbye. This is his first Travis McGee novel. Uh, And see the two E's and the two O's, two by two. Uh, this will be uh, my first Johnny McDonald novel, uh, and I have been collecting his uh, Travis McGee novels for some time now. Uh, I've got paperbacks, hardbacks. I love these little uh, faucet, little dime store, drugstore books. Uh, been been collecting them just in case I really like them, uh, and I'll have something else to go into once I'm once I'm finished with this first one. I can keep going. So, if by some miracle, remember the name of my channel, 
I do manage to finish all these books. I will try to take part in a read-along of Lee Child's Killing Floor, which is the first Jack Reacher novel. My wife and I uh, watched the, uh, the series based on this novel uh, on Amazon. Uh, we really liked it. Uh, kind of binge-watched it, actually. And um, hopefully this will be just as good or better. Uh, I'm expecting good things from this from, uh, from the way the TV, the TV series turned out. So, Killing Floor. Hopefully I'll get to that. So those are my plans for March Mystery Madness 2022. I hope you're taking part, and I hope you're going to have a great time. Uh, I expect to. Uh, I expect my wife will as well. Uh, it's going to be fun. It's going to be fun. We're, I'm taking part in some other uh, March reading events, March of the Mammoths. Uh, hopefully I can squeeze that in, at least get started with uh, Middle March. Um, I'm sure I'll get started. I don't know how far I'll get, but anyway, uh, that's my TBR. Uh, until next time, have a good one, BookTube.